Hey, what is going on, my friend? It's Brando Linux here coming to you right out of my home office, and I wanted to turn on the camera and, you know, just really have a candid conversation with you right off the cuff. It's going to be straightforward, no punches thrown, and uh, talk about how to start a business, how to start a business from, you know, some experiences that I've had personally, just to save you a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, having some of those businesses that absolutely failed. Some of them worked, and uh, the example I will be using in this video is the title. Um, which is, you know, how to start a painting business or a painting company. And uh, the reason why I want to use this as an example is I've had a lot of associates, business associates of mine that I've gotten across over the last, like, four years. Um, a lot of people, you know, have ventured down into painting. And uh, a lot of the reasons are very common, um, simple, simplicity of a business. Um, it's painting, you know, it's enjoying and relaxing. And um, if you're looking at it for very similar reasons and you want to be your own boss, you want to take control of your income, I would actually suggest before you consider starting your own painting business, your own painting company, um, unless when you look at it from a long-term perspective, you're looking at franchising out, which even with franchising out, I'm just you know warning you here, dealing with franchising, you're looking at managing more people, more equipment, more supplies, more inv inventory and all that which is more investing that you're going to have to put into your business that can cost you tens of thousands of dollars. But it's not just that. It's after all the money that you put in, the work required, maintaining it. The time that you have to put in that you cannot get back. Time is like the number one commodity in the world, right? And it's going to decrease the amount of time freedom that you have because you'll have more to manage. So that's just something you got to be aware of. And like I said, if you're looking at this for very similar reasons, you want to start a business to be your own boss, you want to start a business to, you know, do what you're passionate about, whether that's traveling around the world or just, you know, going and building wells in third world countries or building schools. I've got a lead I want to throw your way here. If you're really looking at a business to do what you want to do, create leverage and flexibility before you consider starting a painting business. And this will save you a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. It's very critical you know this. So by the end of this video, you can make an informed decision. And the lead I'm going to throw your way is actually what happened to me going back about a year ago, just over a year ago, when I transitioned from traditional business and I came across a person who's not average or typical. And uh, I'm not guaranteeing you their same results, but they're building a business on the internet without the infrastructure of any type of traditional business or the example in this video of the in infrastructure of a painting business like supplies, equipment, employees, driving around and you know painting and doing all this stuff and because they weren't doing that didn't have any of that building a business right from their laptop and computer not average or typical results this person was making a high multiple six figure income having time freedom, location freedom to do what they want literally wherever they wanted and making more money every month than I was making a whole year and because they were doing that I couldn't help but reach out to them it was really attractive what they were doing I mean come on <laughs> and, uh, you know I started modeling copy what they're doing with their permission in less than 30 days after that alright I was able to put my traditional businesses that I've been running off to the side and walk away from corporate America because long story short when I was running those businesses I was working in corporate America to fund those businesses and it was crazy stuff and I would advise you if you're looking at starting a business because you want to create a simple business and you know you can make money at, one where you can do what you want when you want, learn to build a business on the internet. Learn to get the results that you want building a business online if that's what you're looking for it from. All right, if you're looking at it because you really are just passionate about painting, that's your thing, then comment down below and I'll point you in the right direction. But if you're looking at a business to be your own boss, create leverage and flexibility, afford what you want, but have the time freedom to enjoy that, learn to build a business on the internet. And if this makes sense to you logically from a business standpoint, you're coachable, you're willing to work, you're willing to learn some things. If that's you, if I'm speaking to you, make sure after this video, connect with me on my site. Check it out. It's 123marketingtips.com. I'll put the link in the description below. And my friend, I appreciate you. I look forward to seeing your success story regardless if you decide to join me on the other side or you want to stick to this side and you want to keep walking down the path. That's totally fine. And uh, I look forward regardless to seeing you on the beaches of the world as well. Take care.